busted by social media. A Facebook post called out a Ferndale cop for parking in a handicapped space. And the department responded on Twitter with a message letting everyone know it is not okay. Amen to that. 7 Action News reporter Naya Harden tells us it is serving as a lesson to everybody. It was right here where someone spotted that police officer parked in a handicapped zone. Police say he was grabbing a quick cup of coffee at McDonald's. This may be a first. The Ferndale Police Department admitted their officer made a boo-boo. Thursday morning, they tweeted a picture of a cop car parked in a handicapped spot on Woodward. The tweet says, this is not okay. This is not the way we roll. We have dealt with this. It's not in our value system to do stuff like this. It was a hastily made, poorly made decision. Sergeant Brown says that officer was making a coffee stop early in the morning and says there was nowhere to park. It wasn't until that photo got posted on social media and the department found out. We want to apologize if anyone was in the lot that needed that space. We get it. We understand. It's not the way we roll here. And you know how back in the day you may not have heard about this? Brown says people have a right to know. Hiding things like this, sweeping them under the rug. I think as time goes on, more and more police departments are going to handle things like this. We can't hide it. It happened. It was a mistake. There was no uh, malice in the officer's heart. And just remember, if an officer can't get a free pass, neither can you. Regardless of whether there's zero spots left that aren't handicapped or a whole bunch of them, if you're not handicapped, if you don't have a sticker, don't park in the spot. Parking in a handicapped zone illegally can cost you $100. Police have not released how they'll discipline that officer, but say it will be taken care of. Naya Harden, 7 Action News.